being introduced at the same time that Trump is proposing to cut the EPA's budget by one third. So it's unclear if the agency would be able to comply. So what will this mean for the agency? On the one hand, there's very dramatic cuts to the research and science capacity of the agency that are being proposed. On the other hand, there are more burdens being imposed on the agency. So what's really the goal here? is the goal to protect public health. Hi people, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Cheshta and welcome to a day in my life vlog. It is quite surprising to myself how, how am I keeping up with a video week. So the day started off pretty late i mean i thought i'm gonna wake up early but fir man no bajuti so late and i had a class at 11 50 so that was fine made it to the class well in time i had so many plans i had to go to the gym so this was supposed to be a productive vlog but now this is going to be slightly unproductive because we could not do what we planned to do you cannot always make it to your plans but Slowly and gradually, they are increasing the pressure and the workload. In the beginning, it looked like, oh my god, we're gonna survive so easily. But then, gradually, you realize that, shit, there's so much to do. And there's so little time. So right now, I just got done with that 11.50 class. And then I went for lunch with friends. Um, and I just came back to my room and have another class at 3.10. I so have 1 hour and 10 minutes in hand and I have to do some readings again so this is basically the weekly schedule on our university portal that I missed gym in the morning I'm gonna try to make it either in the evening or I would rather go swimming I'm just gonna do one of it
You in the backyard of your old farm in the summer. Stayed there for three weeks where we learned to love each other. Wrote you a letter, sent a message to the captain. Skipped to the present, haven't been so. Long.